Hello, Internet, and welcome to my live reaction for Fire Brigade of Flames, Chapter 129. Uh, when we last left off, um, Joker versus the Jester Captain, as the fight um, continued, and uh, it looked like just, uh, Joker was like on his like last legs, but he pulled off a win in the nick of time uh, with a bit of hallucin uh, hallucinogens and card tricks, uh, right as the big twist at the end of the chapter that Burns is at least heavily affiliated with the Jesters and is coming to fight uh, Joker. So we have a cover page uh, that is like the two faces split down the middle, like all those old Kakashi Obito pictures back in like Kakashi Gaiden, um, with Joker on one side and Burns on the other. In this side, there is darkness. In this side, there is light. Darkness is Joker's eye, uh, light is Burns's. The path that each eye saw differs. Chapter 129, Double One-Eyed. Uh, the scan later page. And then we see... I don't know what this page is. Uh, hello, you punks. I'm Azuchi Okubo, author of Fire Force. Do you enjoy reading my manga? Well, guess what? Uh, guess what? I'm going to Japan Expo Convention next July in France. Hope to meet you there. So if you're in France, then I guess you have that. But I am not in France. I am in America. Sorry. Uh, okay. So anyway, we cut, we were right where we right where we left off last week as Burns approaches Joker. Both look like super casual. Um, they kind of, like, stare at each other. We just see their eye patches right now, which I find really interesting. A really interesting choice. Really? So to get the Holy Scriptures, I'll have to defeat you. For someone who has been hiding in the shadows. This, this is pretty daring of you. That's because I don't want the truth to stay hidden. Come. I'm like, Joker now has more cards. I thought they were all just throwing the fight with the captain, but I guess not. Um, and they're, like, floating in the air behind him. Uh, as uh, Burns like eggs him on, and Benny Maru like joins the, joins in the fun. I guess he's I guess he beat the jesters already. Uh, you know they were minor enough. I don't really care. Sounds like fun. Let me join the fight too. And they all stare each other down. Commander Shinbon, what's wrong? We doing this or what? I just realized now is not the time to fight. Let's hear what you have to say. What? And Joker's like, huh? Uh, what? Did the strong man change your mind? You're the one who thought that a fight between commanders would be interesting. And Hajima has some dangerous people. If you didn't come to fight, what do you want? You seek the secret of the Church of the Holy Sun, right? I came to give you a clue. A clue? I still don't get it. Why is the first company commander here? More importantly, do you two already know each other? Burns was the link between the light and shadows of the Church of the Holy Sun. And, back then, he took care of me. Okay. Also, I want to point out how similar, Bur just like uh, like a, a first glance, uh, we see like a flashback of Joker back when he's 52 and a younger Burns, and how similar his outfit looks to like the White Hoods. So definitely, you know, ramping up the connections between the church and the White Hoods. Just saying, once again, uh, until he formed that Adora link. Uh, oh. I guess the Adora Link is his eye, but should I always get the Adora Link and the Adora Burst confused? Is, is it the Adora Link or the Adora Burst that are, that are the eight pillars? I can never remember. Um, but if it is the Adora Link, does that mean that Burns is one of the pillars? That doesn't seem right. Uh, so, yeah. Joker says, until he formed that Adora Link. Adora Link. I heard Shinra the Eighth talk about it. It happened when Amaterasu released a ton of flame humans. Oh. Am Amaterasu releasing flame humans? That's a new thing, isn't it? I didn't know there were... I mean, we knew there were people in the Amaterasu. I guess it's unleashing flame humans into the world? Alright, that's, that's interesting. I never heard about this. Of course not. Not when Amaterasu needs to be seen as totally safe. Something like that won't be reported. That's why there are people that do the dirty work. And we see Burns in his, like, firefighter outfit, and 52 young Joker or whatever 
in some like weird, super large cloak. Just one more. Yeah. <coughs> the other shadows must have been defeated. Is the target up ahead? Yeah. And we see a, like a flame human uh, further. This looks like it's in the Nether. It's mine. And uh, Joker like has a sword like pop out of his arm. I like pop out like this way, not like pop out of his arm. You know what I mean? On uh, the flying human, which looks super alien, like it has these like things like crowding around its mouth. It's super weird. Uh, and Burns kind of stares at it. Wait, and he holds Joker back. Something strange here. I don't care. And Joker like runs past him. And the and the alien flying human has this like like wall like wave of fire rush out at Joker. Uh, as the two of them, like, kind of, like, hunker down and try to, like, beat it out. And there's this, like, pain ringing in their ears. They both, like, clutch their ears. Uh, and they're screaming. A lot of screaming. And we see three lines go across. I think that's Joker's eye? And maybe Burns' is too. But it looks like it's just Joker's eye. Burns, what's the outside world like? And then we cut to a flashback within the flashback. Does human combustion still happen? Yes. Flame humans continue to pop up. Above ground, the nether, both places suck. The world is full of sorrows, and everyone expects the sun god to finish them off. Can people be saved just by praying to and depending on God? No. Nor do I expect any salvation. I want something tangible. There's only hate in this world. Religion. Politics. Anyone's goodwill only exists when it's convenient. The world is going to shit. I want to understand, why is the world so shitty? I want to know the truth. Adora, and then we cut back to where they are, the Adora Link. Uh, and they see the preacher, and this fucking crazy-ass vision. There was, like, a weird castle underneath the preacher, and, like, planets with eyeballs on them all around the preacher. Uh, dimension, truth, laws, insect... World, hell, mathematics, God, God. And they're screaming in pain. Oh, so this is how both of them lost their eyes. Because we see uh, Joker's eyes, like, burning up as he's howling and, like, scratching at the ground. Uh, and Burns' eye is also burning. Ugh, 52! My eye! And the flame human, like, rushes at them. And Burns, like, gets his arm ready and just piles it through the flame human's chest. Wow. 52, are you okay? Uh, uh, uh. And there's, they're still, like, writhing in pain. What did we see? Was that an illusion? Uh, and another flame, like, burns on Joker's hand? That was no illusion. We were dragged somewhere else. Look at this. Uh, and, uh, no, he's not, his, it's not his hand is burning in, in flame. He has a rock that's burning in flame. The other world exists. So, and then they're back in the present. So, how's the stone? The one you brought from Adora? is bottled in the vacuum, yet keeps burning. The existence of a higher dimension that you and I saw. The church is hiding something very important. You want to know the truth? Follow this clue. You can have this. And he hands Joker an old diary. What was given is an old diary. The hidden truth is a poison that will shake the world. To be continued after 130, Hidden Truth. Okay. There is a lot to dig into uh, this week. So yeah, I'm pretty sure it is the Adora versus the Pillars. I don't know why I always get that confused. Because I think the Adora Link is just having seen Adora. Um, not, it's not something you possess. Again, I I've, I've know I've had this problem like so many times over the past, what, two years I've been doing this series. Um, and still, I just cannot keep it straight. Uh, one of these days, I will get it straight in my mind. Um, but yeah, we see how they lost their eyes, their first interaction with the fact that there is a higher truth to the world around them. Uh, excuse me. A higher truth to the world around them. Um, what else? There's a lot going on in this chapter. Um, but also not a whole lot. Uh, we saw where... So I'm still... I'm kind of curious where Burns' allegiance lies. Because we know the First Brigade is heavily tied to the church. Uh, we also know that Burns is the leader of the First Brigade, and so he's, like, especially tied to the church. 
And yet here he is kind of betraying the church. But he's also not willing to just go outright and say, you know, here's what the church is up to. You got to stop this shit. He's like, yeah, here's a diary. You figure it out. Um, so I don't know if he's just, like, not certain if he can trust Benny Maru and Joker. Um, or if, like, I don't know. Maybe the diary is meant to, like, deceive them. But if not, but if it is, why not just tell them the deception right away? Um, I like tell him what the, he wants them to discover in the diary. I mean, not tell him he's deceiving them. Um, also, I'm a little disappointed that we didn't get to see a Joker ver uh, Benny Maru and Joker versus Burns fight because that was something that was really teased up last week, and now, then it all just kind of like went away. Um, but yeah, this was still a really you know interesting chapter. Uh, I'm really interested in what the fuck. Like, like, all our images of Adora so far have been, like, a very kind of, kind of cliche, I guess, like, hellscape. You know, everything's burning, everything is bad, this is hell. It's like, if you picture hell in your mind, that's what Adora is. Until tonight, uh, when we saw, you know, planets around the preacher with eyeballs in them. They look kind of like, uh, fuck, what's that monster? Uh, I think it's Cyberjar in Yu-Gi-Oh. Uh, like, the, like the the thing that like like there's like a kind of like a ball with an eye on the on like the top of it. You know what I mean? Uh, the, like it's a, the monster in a jar. Um, like it's kind of what they look like. Um, but I don't know what they're about. Um, I don't know. I I I don't have any idea. Um. I don't know if that's going to matter at some point. Who knows? Might just be a weird effect thing that Okubo drew. Um, but yeah. There is a whole lot to say. Or there's a whole lot to think about going into next week. Where hopefully we'll find some tidbits of what is actually going on. And the two like very different... Um, you know, there are so many different like, conflicting things about the truth of the world going on. As I mentioned before. You know, just looking at the Amaterasu with who created it, was it Vulcan's family or the church, um, or, you know, how the great disaster happened, what happened in the past, and hopefully that will all start to get cleared up real soon. Mainly because I'm discovered I'm not really a big fan of, like, conflicting backstories kind of deal. So I hope that's ironed out fairly quickly. I'm still, you know, this, this arc has been amazing so far. Seeing Joker really, like, go at it. But really, the f this is kind of the first time we've seen him had a full fight. Like, he sparred, I think, with Shinra back in, like, the rookie tournament in, like, the single-digit chapters. He had, like, a quick clash with Sho at the end of the workshop arc. And other than that, he's kind of just been, like, on the sidelines, you know, giving dramatic uh, responses, giving dramatic, like, clues and shit to people. Um, though now he's the one looking for clues. How's that for a reversal? Um... But yeah, that's kind of really all there is to talk about this week. This was a really fun chapter. Again, the series has been getting better and better and better as it's gone on. And I'm super happy to, you know, be talking about it. Um, also, please, this is, I feel like any day now we're going to get an anime announcement. Uh, I'm really upset that I don't think that's going to happen anytime soon, in all honesty. But it, it feels like we should get an anime announcement. Because it's really heating up. There's plenty of material for it, even if the beginning is kind of meh. You know, as it gets on, it gets better and better and better. Um, but yeah, I want that, but that's really not the point of this video. I don't know why I brought that up. Yay for ADD. Yay for being off my meds. Um, so yeah, I'm going to leave this video off here. I hope you all enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed the chapter and the video. If you did, join me a like, subscribe, whatever the fuck you want. And as always, people, keep kicking ass, and I'll see you in the future. Bye.